Let's get this fishing to level 99. Guys, welcome back to Idle Guard. Today, we have already gone through the entirety of woodcutting to 99. We have gotten so many resources. We've gotten over 18 million. We have over 50 slots in our bank, but we now need to be working on fishing because this is going to help us with a lot of stuff long term. Now, stuff that I've gotten ahead of time on this is uh, we have Ty. If you don't know who Ty is, it gives you a global mastery boost. So definitely looking forward to that. However, if you have not already smashed the like button and done the same with the subscribe button, please make sure you do that. These videos do take a while for me to produce because I'm literally doing an entire week's of work as fast as possible. So I greatly appreciate it. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm still actually woodcutting. I literally just finished the other video and I'm in the process of uploading it. So we're just going to go ahead and start off with shrimp. I do actually have to activate that and while that's going on what we're going to do is we're going to go over to fishing rod and we're going to buy the first fishing rod the next fishing rod we cannot get until level 10. so don't need to worry about any of that right now all the extra stuff i don't need to buy so not even going to worry about it so if you didn't know with fishing you're going to get a lot of stuff so we're going to get some junk and we're going to get a lot of food so I am actually going to be keeping as much of this as possible. There's going to be a couple points that I will just farm up some certain items. So we, we're getting some food. Uh, we got an old hat. Great. That's exactly what I needed. But things like the rusty key and the old hat, more than likely we will just be selling. But right now we're just trying to level up. Just trying to get shrimpy. And just trying to get this up to level 5 so we can worry over to the Schnarpno River. I don't even know how to say that. I'm not even going to try. No. Mm -mm. So with this, this is not so much as picking which one gives the most XP. Is literally, I'm probably just going to be working through this. So we have 5, 8, 10, 20. That's a big gap there. That's 10 points. Oof. Uh, then we have 30 over here. And I do believe 35. And then we have 40. 50 unlocks two different areas. There will be some of these that actually help us with other skills. So definitely going to be taking advantage of that. Uh, with this one on the checkpoints, I am actually going to be trying and keeping as much XP as I can. Because we, we definitely want to receive no more junk. We're going to want to be getting fish only. Because uh, that's going to help us the most with XP. Although some of the junk we do actually want. So we will have to keep an eye out for that. So, so far I have gotten a shell. Great, thanks. A key, and we've already talked about the hat, and a lot of shrimpies. So I'm going to move the shrimp over the food tab that I have going. So this is our current food tab that I've been working on some stuff with farming. Because uh, this is also, along with me making each of these guys, getting them up to level 99. Uh, we're also getting farming up on its own. So... Farming will be the only one in the series I do not have an actual video for because we're going to be working on it while we're going. Uh, we're already halfway through level 2. There's not really anything I can do to make this go faster. How fishing mechanic works is you're given a time window. Basically within this window is how long it takes to catch the fish. It can take me 3 seconds. It can take me 7 seconds. It can be anywhere in between. So this is... Uh, <laughs> starting off this is really slow. It's Really, really slow. There's a, actually a couple of really cool items we can get from here that we can use for other things. So I'm kind of hoping we get them early on, but we shall see. If you are wanting a list of these special items, uh, let's go over to Wiki. So let's go ahead and take a look at basically the Wiki. So if you're not familiar with the Wiki, I would definitely go and check it out. It is a wonderful resource because there is hundreds of items in this game. And finding all of them sometimes is a giant pain in the backside. So what I would do, just personally me, go through here and look. There is so many fish. A lot of these are going to be helping us with strength. This goes through the skill capes. This goes even through the ducky. This goes through what all the rods do. These go through also the special items. So we have a couple of special items in here along with gemstones. We have treasure chest. We have the barbarian gloves, which you're really going to want. We have the message in the bottle. Really also hoping for the Pirate's Lost Ring, the Ancient Ring of Mastery, and the Ancient Ring of Skills. 
So those are definitely going to be some harder ones. They also have the Amulet of Fishing. So we're going to be looking out for a couple of items to help think, make things easier for us. There's also a couple of fish. Uh, it would be Leaping Trout, Leaping Salmon, and Leaping Broadfish will actually train our strength. So those are things to note. And then there's a couple of other fish that do other things that are part of other things. But what we're not going to be doing is we're not going to be cooking anything. Nothing will be cooked. Or nothing will be sold. We're going to be keeping all the fish we get. We have enough money from woodcutting that we really do not need anything else. So super excited for this. But yeah, let's get back to the game. And fishing level 10. So we are immediately going to go over to the raw herring. And we're going to start fishing on that. We're also going to go over to the shop. And we're going to get the next fishing rod. So this is going to help decrease the interval even more. So our next fishing rod is at level 20. We still have plenty of resources in order to get this, so nothing I'm too worried about at the moment. If we go back down to fishing, this is going to keep going. Our next changeover, I do believe, is level 20. Yeah, level 20. So we're going to be stuck here for a little bit working on some of the herring. I kind of do want some of the special items, but we do need to farm a little bit of this. So I'll probably get this up to about 16, 17 with the raw herring, and then I will probably switch back over to the blowfish. So I'm not going to bring y'all back for this. I'm trying to make these uh, 1 to 100 skill videos as short as possible. Ooh, we got our first special item. We got a lovely emerald. So I could, I could, I could. I so, I so want to sell that. I so want to sell that to use that. But we are going to keep that because uh, we have plenty of money right now. There is, there is no reason for us to do that. So we're already working on blowfish. We're only almost 17. I just wanted to bring y'all back because we did get our first special item. So the rest of this, I, I don't know what we're going to do with yet. I have yet to decide. <laughs> but yeah, we're probably going to sell it. I'm just keeping it. We don't need the inventory space just yet. So I'm just going to keep rocking and rolling. Uh, almost level 20 so we can get the next rod. And we can go on to the next area. And we are officially fishing level 20. So while that is going on, I'm going to stop fishing in that. We're going to go over to the trout, which I've kind of already leveled up a little bit. I've been using some of the XP we've been getting. So let's go ahead and start on that. Uh, we did manage to get the barbarian gloves, which this will give us access to the barbarian in the fishing area. So if we go down here, we now have the leaping trout we have access to. Which I may end up going and doing that because that's 20 XP and it potentially could take less time. We're not going to have any chance for specials down here. But we're going to be able to start getting our strength up which is going to kind of be nuts. So uh, let's just go ahead and switch on over down here. I already got some of the trout so that'll work. Uh, we don't need two of these so we're going to be making some cash. We do need to go to the shop before I stop squirreling and we need to get the black fishing rod and we can get a level 20 so let's go ahead and purchase that next rod is not until level 35 so that's pretty pretty straightforward and now our fishing times have dramatically decreased so that's 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 nice that's really nice so i'm probably gonna stop spending uh so much xp i was kind of starting to do a little bit but now we're kind of we're we're flying through this but i gotta remember that we're gonna be flying through everything so let me straighten up some inventory spots here. We're going to move that over to food. We're going to move that gemstone over to our lovely little gemstone area. So we've gotten two gemstones. I've gotten a ton of just random, random stuff. And we're getting our strength up. So one of the big things I'm going to be focusing on while we're working on fishing. So level 20 all the way until, I don't know, some other point in time uh pretty much just gonna try and be sticking down here with the trout and everything uh probably until level 35 and 70 the only thing i will break away for is to get some of the bonefish just because those fish are gonna give us an absolute monster amount of like we need that for prayer we need that for prayer a lot of this is going to be working on other skills at the same time so things like that one thing I will note is I kind of have figured out the next um, skill we're going to be going into, and that's going to be astrology, because that's going to give us boosts across the board. 
The next video after this, I'm letting y'all know, is just going to be me talking about the bonuses getting in astrology. So there may be a lapse in like time while I'm working on astrology because I'm, I'm doing some math on these and the regular skills are probably going to take me about a week apiece to complete. And But if I get astrology up, it's probably going to give me a little bit more of a hand. So I'm probably going to be working on astrology very, very heavily. And agility, I'm not even touching right now. I'm not going to touch agility until like the very, very end. I probably will work on combat prior to that. But what this is going to do is it's going to give us XP for combat. Our strength's already up to level 4. We haven't even leveled up in fishing yet. I'm going to keep going. I will bring y'all back, I guess, I want to have to say probably around 35. Because it's probably when we will switch over to the 35 one down here. Okay, we are almost at 35 right now, but we got a lot of goodies. We got a lot of goodies, so I want to bring you back. So we got some rubies, some sapphires, and some diamonds. And of course, we've gotten some more emeralds and topaz over there. So I'm going to move all of this over. And then I'm actually going to need to um, buy more spots. <laughs> we have pretty much almost maxed out our bank. So I'm going to move this all the way up to 70 now because we have we have just been getting so much stuff. It's like insane. So and bank spots are getting really stupid expensive now. We're at 147. So it took us probably close to a million. Uh, we now also are fishing 35, so we can go ahead and get the mithril fishing rod. The next fishing rod's at level 50. And it's going to cost 75,000. Let's go back to fishing. We're going to go to Leaping Salmon, which I've actually been working on this just a little bit. So we're going to start Leaping Salmon. Apparently it's already at level 60. I didn't realize I'd gotten it up that high. So we also have unlocked the raw poison fish. Not going to work on that right now. There's no real reason for me to. Uh, how this is already up to 46, so I've been spending some XP. I want to get that up to 50 because if we go over to... The mastery unlocks at 50, we get a 3% chance to get some special items. So that's kind of what I'm looking for is I want those special items because we want that treasure chest, all that good jazz. So we got some leaping salmon. All right, I'm just going to keep working on fishing. At 45, we're going to have access to our lovely skeleton fish. So we may go over and do that. I have not decided yet. We don't actually have the area unlocked for it. Uh, we need a message in a bottle, and we actually have not gotten that as a drop, so I don't have access to that area yet. So as of right now, we're just kind of waiting until we can get a fishing rod and getting to level 70, unless I can get a message in a bottle, but I haven't seen one yet, so that's kind of part of the junk that we need to get. But I'll bring it back if something else happens. We got our first treasure chest. We also got some bar more barbarian gloves that I don't need. Apparently we just got a diamond as I'm looking at the screen, but we got a treasure chest. So let's view chest contents. We can get an old boot, a bunch of garbo, some cook stuff, and an amulet of fishing. I really want that amulet of fishing. The bars and stuff will help us out other ways, but yeah. Glass bottle. Ah, that's poop. Oh well. But definitely a good start. Um, we are still working on leaping salmon. Uh, if y'all didn't know, I didn't remember if I showed this in the previous clip, but our strength is already up to level 30. So what this does for strength is help with combat damage. So melee damage specifically, this is going to increase our max hit. So yeah, we we already have <laughs> already given ourselves an additional 30 on that. So that's kind of why I'm also getting this up. So it's also easier when we go and... Switch over to combat because we will basically be doing a lot more damage. So that's going to be truly, truly nice. Not really sure anything else. Yeah, that's kind of it. I mean, this is this is like so slow. Uh, we just hit level 40. Yay! I don't think we can get anything. No, we need level 50. Never mind. I got excited for nothing. We did unlock lobster, which lobster is really good. Uh, sells for a lot, heals a lot, but again, I'm not interested in doing that until we get to 70, mostly because I want to farm up our specials. I also want to farm up strength stat. So I'm going to keep going on the leaping salmon because I, we're not going to be able to get strength the 99 from this, but we are definitely going to get it up there. Okay. We just hit level 50. So awesome sauce. Uh, we got anglerfish, swordfish is now available. I haven't really gotten anything else. We have more barbaric gloves, which I don't need. 
We got a mastery token. Let's go ahead and claim that. Let's go ahead and open these treasure chests. See if we get anything good. Oh, we got rope. No, we got garbo. Absolute garbo. So I'm going to go ahead and sell the barbarian gloves because we don't need that. And we're going to keep... Actually, we go to the shop now. We go to the shop and I get the eminent fishing pole. Awesome. Uh, Yeah, our strength is at 40. We're already at level 50. So I'm just going to keep rocking and rolling on these leaping salmon because we're getting a ton. I got 3% special. No reason to keep changing. All right, so we're back. So we're actually at 55 right now. I've just literally been having it run on Leaping Salmon this whole time. Uh, it's at level 80, which means we no longer are getting junk and we have a 3% bonus for special. So this is kind of all we've just been doing. I've gotten a couple of special treasure chests, but they haven't really resulted in anything. Uh, good, a uh, ton of gems, which is really nice. That's gonna kind of help us. You need gems for bolts. You make potions with some of them, so. Just kind of collecting, just trying to get through this one as quickly as possible. Uh, and we're already strength level 46, which makes our combat level 18. So that's actually really, really cool. I really, really like that we've already rocketed through that. And I have farming all the way up to the level 56. So this video is going to be significantly shorter than the first one. The first one was us setting everything up. We already have a lot of money. So now we don't have to worry about as much. Uh, the next big milestone just kind of bringing y'all back, is going to be level 60 when we can get the rune fishing rod. So that'll kind of be the next big thing. Uh, there is some stuff that we could go get in thieving. So we can go down here to thieving real quick. I don't know if it'll show me all of them, but there are a few others down here that some of their drops have things that actually help with like, the fishing. So, but I can't get that right now. All right, so we came back after a little while, longer after I left y'all. Uh, strength is at 48. Fishing is now at 58. Let's go. Still not at 60, which is what I was hoping for. Oh, we got two treasure chests. I've already opened a few. Haven't gotten anything decent. Uh, rusty key. We got a mithril bar. Nice. So that'll help us with some crafting. But yeah, nothing too, nothing too special. So this is probably going to get left overnight. I may try to see if we can round up fishing. Uh, it's getting pretty close. Hmm. What I may end up doing is, what is one of the higher? I'd rather leave it AFKing on one of those guys. Um, the raw fan fish. Going to be the most recent one. That's going to give us 120. So I will go ahead and fish for that. We're already at 5% up here. I am going to let this probably roll up as high as it can so we can get, you know, no junk from anything. So I'll let that roll up a little bit. Hopefully we can get uh, level 60 before I have to AFK for the night. All right, so we just hit level 60. So we can go ahead and go to the shop. We go to the shop. We can go ahead and get the rune rod. It's going to give us another minus five fishing interval for 300k. Uh, the next one is the dragon fishing rod, and this will be the final one at level 80. So let's go ahead and check on what we got going on under fish. So... I'm about to leave this to go AFK overnight. So we're going to go after the anglerfish. And hopefully in the morning, we wake up to some glorious, glorious numbers. I'm going to go ahead and move the anglerfish over to the fishing area. You can go over there with the other guppies. We have so many fish. So keep in mind, if you did want to sit there and sell these, you can. But, I mean, it's not really... We're, we're going to be getting into the good fish. We're going to be getting into the good money here in a little bit. So kind of keep kind of keep your horses there. And we do have some food starting out, so that's good. But yeah, I'm going to go and leave this AFK overnight. This is progressing significantly faster than trees if you followed my, that video for me. And so this is, this is why I recommend doing trees first, because we're going to get so much stuff set up. And uh, I'll let y'all take a look also at how many gems we got. This is the gem breakdown. I could also sell some of these, not going to, because we're keeping them for later on. We'll also get some gems when we start working on mining, but yeah. So, I'll see y'all in the morning. Alrighty, so I'm back after a overnight AFK, and we got we got a lot of stuff. We got a message in a bottle, too, which is really, really good. Uh, we're now level 68, would appear. Let's go ahead and get some of these mastery tokens going. Message in a bottle. Let's go ahead and read that. So we get the secret fishing area unlocked, which is really good. Uh, treasure chest. Let's open these up. 
Rusty keys, old hat. No, that's real nothing good. Sad. Sad, 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 sad. But we already read this item, so we can, uh, I do believe sell this now. There we go. We don't need that no more. So we now have the secret fishing area unlocked, which gives us raw seahorse and raw skeleton fish. Skeleton fish are 45, but I do want to work on these because skeleton fish, like, no joke, give so much. Like, it's pretty much you need them for prayer uh, to start off. Uh, they do also give some good resources, like, they, I mean, they, they still a lot, but you can get prayer points. And I probably at some point I'm just going to AFK for the full 18 hours that you can, just so I can load up on those. But currently we are sitting at about halfway through 68, and we need to be 70 for the next barbarian fishing that I'm wanting to do, so we're not quite there yet, sadly. Sadly. But uh, probably going to find, I think, Rock Carp, actually. Yeah, Rock Carp's going to give us 130 XP. Skeleton Fish gives us that. Weirdly enough, I'm looking at this, and um, Rock Crab, like the time needed, is significantly less. So it may be actually more worthwhile for us to go over there. I'm kind of really staring at these Skeleton Fish, though, because uh, that 5% special. So once it gets up high enough, it could be even more. So I'm probably just going to work on 68 to 70, just going to be doing the skeleton fish and applying all of those to our prayer points so we can start getting some because our, our strength's already at 48, so. <laughs> but I'll bring it back when uh, we're at 70. Okay, I may have left this a little longer than I intended, but we are back. There we go. All right, let's go ahead and hit that. We are now fishing level 73. So let's go ahead and get started on some broadfish. I already have it up to level 62. We can immediately start working on that. That's 25 XP also for strength. So that'll actually be really good. Our XP is going to slow down a little bit. But here's the caveat here. What we're going to do is once we hit about 85, so 85, I'm actually going to work on the raw magic fish because this this thing is insane as far as like XP and it's also going to be really good for food. So we can keep the raw magic fish long term. We also can sell it if we need to. So that'll be a different money maker for us to go for. Uh, kind of kind of thinking at level 80 switching over once we get the new fishing rod, but we will see. I really want to keep using the broad leaping fish. I am kind of hoarding everything at the moment, and yeah, I know. So I'm going to use these fishing mastery tokens. So what is our mastery at now? We're at 4%. I'm not going to... I used a ton of this earlier, so I will just keep this from now on. Uh, message in a bottle. We've already used that, so we can sell that outright. Uh, treasure chest. Let's go ahead and open these bad boys up. Nothing of value. All right, so our new fishing friends are going to get moved over to there. And I'm not going to claim this prayer, uh, prayer points just yet. So there is going to be probably a point where I just kind of grind up some different stuff, uh, like in between a video or while we're working on something else. I'll come back and get some more because uh, this is not enough to start cooking. <laughs> so I'll meet y'all back at level 80. Alrighty, so come back. Been AFKing a little bit, we're now level 80, and we can get the raw magic fish, which is what we really, really want. So I'm gonna immediately go ahead and start that. Even though these take forever, take absolutely forever to catch, they're gonna give us an absolute ton, ton of money. This is gonna be our main money source with fishing. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy the dragon rod as well. So now we are just Kind of waiting to get maxed out. Uh, managed to get enough XP to get the 10%. Fortunately, don't have the junk or the double or any of that. So getting to the 95 95% on this is going to be super, super important. This is just going to take a while. So this is getting a ton of XP, though. So uh, only other real things to note is um, a little full in inventory space again. Open up those treasure chests, didn't get anything, man. I was hoping to get something, but 
Ugh. Food to new tab. Let's go ahead and scoot this over to the food. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and buy another five slots just because we are very quickly running out. And that's gonna kind of be the common theme for this. So now it's up to 75. Uh, I know you can get free bank slots later on, but we're not quite there yet. So I'll bring it back if we get like a really cool item. I really want a special item. That's kind of what I'm looking for. Open. Open. Open, open, open. So I don't know if that's actually better for me just to go after shrimp because that's, that's a long time waiting for that because that's uh, seven seconds, but it's 325 XP. Hmm. I do know that when we can get whale, I probably will go after whale, but for now I'm just going to go after the magic fish. Because uh, near the end, I mean, that this thing sells for a thousand apiece, pretty much. So, yeah. Alright guys, so we finally hit 85. 85, I uh, haven't been getting anything good. Which is kind of making this a little disheartening. So we just got the Ray Manta... Over here, uh, it takes less time than the raw magic fish, so I'm probably gonna have it start and we're gonna get a ton, a ton of XP. So this should hopefully help us get up to the whale, which is the last one right here. We will be farming up the whale because that that thing is worth a ton of money. So I'm gonna let this roll for a while, and uh, I'll bring y'all back. And uh, after we get to 99, I'll kind of talk about what we're going to do. Because one of the other things that has occurred is I have pretty much run out of seeds. Alright, so I just got back after a long way of K away. And uh, we we got something beautiful. So let's go check it out. We're now level 89 too. So that'll help. But yeah, we got the Lost Pirate Ring. Definitely going to be equipping that. We got some mastery tokens. Let's open up these treasure chests. See if we got anything good. Nope. Mm. All the barbarian gloves. Do not need those. Yeah, we're going to be getting some nice XP. We also no longer receive junk from anything. So the next thing that we get unlocked, I'm now on the manta rays, is going to be the big boy whale. The big boy whale here in just a little bit. So I may bump him up a little bit just so he is super, super easy to get, but we'll see about that. But yeah, that's so close. Alrighty guys, so near in the end, we're finally at 95. We're over halfway. So I am going to switch. How long is the whale taking? That's a lot of XP though. That's a lot of XP. So I'm going to go ahead and jump on over there. Got a ton of stuff. We got a lot of fishing mastery tokens. Let's go ahead and sell these barbarian gloves. Open these treasure chests. Oh, we got the amulet of fishing finally. Only took forever. <laughs> so we'll get a minus 15 fishing interval, so that'll make that even better. And let's go ahead and move all of this over. Y'all were harping at me to do this. I like, I like doing the clicking. I like doing the clicking. And there is skill level 9 to 9 for fishing. So we are able to go by the fishing cape in the shop. That's not the shop. Let's go down to the lovely fishing cape. Receive times two items from fishing. Let's go. So we got that. Spent another million. So we have yet another one of those. Didn't get all of the items that have been associated. I managed to get the fishing amulet, the ring. That's kind of been about it. So we didn't quite get everything I would have wanted. We got a ton of food. Got an absolutely ton, ton of stuff. One we can either sell or we can use to eat while we go attack things. But the next skill I'm going to be working on for our 1 to 100, where I get all the skills up to 100, is I'm going to be working on astrology. So astrology is going to give us boost across the board. I'm not going to film this. I'm going to go over what boost I got. Um, I'm going to be farming this for a while. So there may not be an update for this going on for a while. But yeah, I'm going to be working on astrology next just to get all of that situated. So just kind of letting y'all know, I'm probably going to buy some more bank slots. And I, I have no more seeds. I have pretty much run out of seeds. So I'm definitely going to have to kind of farm some of those up. They were kind of at the point where I can't progress until I do some farming. 
So I'm going to go work on astrology. The best thing to do for these is getting them up to uh, 99. So I'm going to get started. And uh, I'll see you all for the next video. Hopefully this was informative.